Hey guys, welcome back to the Farmall Vlog. Glad to have you. Uh, I'm Travis, as you know. Today you'll meet Ben, uh, which you haven't seen as much, but uh, he's been around helping out the whole time. He's been kind of my right hand with this. So we've just done some harvesting last night, and today we've got some excess, so we want to take it over to the soup kitchen and uh, hook those guys up with some fresh greens. So uh, we're also going to do some more harvesting today over at some of the walls, pick up some mint, some basil, you know, just a continual harvest, and uh, drop that off with them as well. So right now we're at the Travel Inn and uh, just snagging up some of this mint and some of the stevia that's up here is growing. Might grab some of that chard too, it looks really good. Uh, from here we'll go ahead and harvest from all four walls, just take a little bit off the top and uh, bring it right back over here to the soup kitchen. Uh, all of these walls are within uh, five blocks from the soup kitchen, so it's that fresh, that close. As you guys can see right here, the towers have just been rocking it this year. Look at all this awesome mint. Delicious, delicious. Everything's been doing really good, really good. Uh, and look at look at these guys right here. We're starting to really do what we had planned on with uh, with getting these tomatoes to trellis out across. Like so, you can see some of the brush right here. This is uh, pretty rare to find some of these red tomatoes over here that everybody likes. More air check out this side. Where's it growing? Look at this. Just cruising right along the trellis. We've almost took up the whole thing. So you can see at the top, the tomatoes came out of the tower and then up into the feed line where the gutter is, and then it's now coming out of the side of it and going up into the window seal. Just killing it. Just kind of look at the size of this broccoli right here. It hasn't turned yet because it's not quite cool enough. But hopefully once this cools down, it'll turn and uh, we'll start to get some production of some broccoli right here. We probably planted it a little bit early, but um, still just doing awesome. Uh, these guys right here are so spicy. It's out of line. I think spicy enough to make salsa out of. I mean, really good. Um, but as you can see, just booming. Meet Ben. This is Ben Weeby. Uh, he's been helping us out a lot with the project. He's pretty much the man. Uh, so here we are over at the soup kitchen, and we're gonna go ahead and meet up with Ted and uh, making some donation of those delicious greens we have here. Hey, hey. how's it going? Good, guys. Doing good. My name is Ted Kramer. I'm the executive director of the Laramie Soup Kitchen. We're an agency in town that provides cooked food to individuals who are hungry. So a good portion of the greens that were just donated will go into salads. Um, whatever we can use will be donated to another nonprofit, Interfaith, for example, to be distributed to other families so that they can have fresh foods. Some of the other items that are um, more interesting, like the basil and the mint, we look forward to using it in either a pesto or to flavor some of our cold beverages that we offer to our guests on a daily basis. Thanks a lot, Ted. Thank you. Appreciate it. It's always good to see you. Absolutely. Hope uh, everybody enjoys it. We look forward to the next harvest. All right, good deal. Hey you guys, thanks for watching today. Uh, glad to have you along with us. Please uh, hit the like button, hit the share button, spread this out. We'd really love to be able to do what we do and uh, to have your guys' support is what allows us to do that. 
Uh, it's all about getting the people hyped up. It's all about taking care of the community and feeding the community and having everybody just be able to walk by and just enjoy this and love it and even steal some of the tomatoes if they want to. Thanks so much for watching guys. Come back next time.